Well, here she is, the old 520. You guys last saw this video, or this tractor in a video where I talked about the repower. But now she, here she is in almost final form. Uh, the only other things that we're gonna do are throw duels on the back, and then obviously put the uh, weight, or put the uh, weights on the outside. The way the uh, dual adapters are sitting over there, I'm gonna be putting a uh, weight box on the back. The weight box is sitting right there. I just gotta find time to do it. Uh, this is like the first time in a couple days I've actually gotten a chance to take a video. Um, for a, you, those of you that don't know, if you're just watch, if you just watch the channel, uh, we're gonna be moving here soon, and I'm just trying to clean out my personal collection. Uh, a lot of people are getting upset with me for some reason because I still am buying and selling tractors. Well, the buying and selling of the tractors pays the bills. So I can sell my personal stuff, say it's a moving sale and it's true, but I can still buy and sell stuff. I, I don't know what people aren't getting about that. It's a little weird. Um, but, yep, here she is. Obviously the factory uh, owning muffler. Uh, this is a quick way loader. Um, I don't know the exact model number on it, but it's the same one that's on the 417. Got the hook on the bucket awesome uh this bucket this thing's great swept forward front axle as you can see uh big one inch spindles exactly the way it should be on a 520 uh gear reduction steering you can see in there uh the 670 predator uh just a generic seat nothing special uh the fuel still fuel tank still in the back um i've also got this which i'm a little still iffy about but it is pretty neat uh, this is foot control for um, driving, so foot control hydro. Um, pop the hood here. In case you guys didn't see the last video. So there she is. There's the old 670. I'm running a four and a half inch pulley on the for the drive, and I believe a four and a half, or no, it's a five inch pulley on the drive, and a four and a half on the. It might be the same size. Never mind. Four and a half on both sides. A four and a half for the pump, four and a half for the uh, drive. Um, I had to bend up the footboard a little bit, but the pump did end up fitting on there, and it's nice and tight. That is a live, all that, that pump is always live. I don't have any type of clutch on it, which I actually like that way better. But if you guys know anything about the Quickway loaders, you'll know that this is a bolt-on loader. There's nothing fancy done to this machine to get this loader on here. Uh, it took me all of maybe, maybe an hour to swap it over from the C125. Um, sorry, just putting the hood back on. But uh, yeah, I call this one Goldie just because it's obviously a 96 50th anniversary model, but people give me all kinds of crap. Or not really, one guy did. Give me all types of crap for putting the Predator in there, putting the loader on it, and the foot control. It's like, it's a it's a freaking tractor. Get over yourself. It wasn't even that good of shape. You can see the hood's all faded. Uh, this, this footboard was cut before I got it. Um, the Onan was junk. You know, it's just like stupid little things, but and I got a lot of hate for the uh, skinny tires in the back But the only reason that is is because I ordered another set of those so I have matching duels on the back um, Yeah, I mean there's the uh, 418 and then in that garage is the 417 I'm selling off the 417 and the 418 in favor of just keeping this thing But Man that motor just really fit in there perfectly and it looks pretty good. It doesn't look like it's all hacked up um, I'm I don't do hack jobs even though according to some people I do. Um, this loader is really awesome. Uh, we'll see if she wants to start. I gotta get a new battery for her. Uh, but as you saw at the beginning of the video, the video isn't running, but. Yep, there we go. She runs great. I mean, you're not gonna get that out of an Onan. No matter how much you love them. Yeah, I just hate Onans. lifts about, I don't know, maybe six foot tall. So, I gotta fix this. I uh, noticed this one was on the other tractor. They ripped the freaking bottom of the pin out and they just got these on there with self tappers. So I gotta fix that, but it is what it is, you know. That's an easy fix. The float function does work. 
And you can see it goes down a little bit slower, but if I want it to go down faster. Plenty of down pressure. An awesome little loader, if I do say so myself. I've already used it quite a bit. I'm clearing some area in the woods for um, two uh, carports so I can store some of my machines when uh, the time comes for pictures to be taken. But Yep, there she is. The old 520 loader.